Six. A report suggests Oklahoma ranks near the bottom for high school athletes that have access to an athletic trainer. The NFL has even taken notice of it and is helping on the football fields in Oklahoma City. Carl Torp tells us more about the partnership and he's on the scene at Taft Stadium. Oklahoma City Public Schools has always had an athletic trainer inside the stadium for a football game, but the practice field has been a different story until now. Good. For Northwest Classic High School football coach Chris Vandersiepen, out there! Preparing for game day means no detail overlooked. Even if they had been for decades, if a player got injured during practice. I can say I think there's this wrong with you from 20 years of experience in football, but I don't feel qualified to tell kids that they've got, you know, a, a bone or a ligament or some other kind of damage. That diagnosis before game day lights go on now comes from a trained professional. Football's our main priority. Athletic trainer Colin Gentry's salary is paid for by a grant from the NFL and a partnership between OKC schools and Mercy Hospitals. I've dealt with some injuries that have been, you know, two to three years old, um, which is kind of crazy when you think about it, um, that they weren't taken care of because no one was here to take care of them. Gentry goes to every football practice and helps rehab students playing other sports as well. A total of four OKC high schools are starting the program this football season. Easy instead of like if you get injured in practice, having to wait until your mom or somebody can take you to the doctor because sometimes that can take weeks. The NFL zeroed in on Oklahoma, which according to one report ranks 49 out of 50 states in access to athletic trainers for high school athletes. We get them a splint and tape them up and we get them. If serious injuries are reduced with the extra help, it is taking a load off of our stress. Expect more trainers to allow coaches. If doesn't get to the end zone, they can return it. To just worry about the X's and O's. On the scene, on the story in Northwest OKC, Carl Torp, News 9. Part of that program includes tracking concussions, and that's something that hasn't been done in Oklahoma City Public Schools athletics.